Korea is today starting a new chapter in its history. The post Park and Hay era is into its second day after the Constitutional Court on Friday voted 8 to 0 to remove her from power. It marks the first time a democratically elected South Korean president has been removed from uh, power. Park was ejected from the top office over a corruption scandal that has plunged Korea into political turmoil and worsened an already serious national divide. Uh, Moon Gon Young starts us off. Interim Chief Justice Lee Jung Mi announced the impeachment verdict of President Park Geun-hye as scheduled on Friday, saying the decision by the eight justices was unanimous. The respondent, President Park Geun-hye, is expelled from office. The respondent has violated the responsibility to diligently carry out her duty as stipulated in the Constitution. Justice Lee first addressed the procedural matters of the trial where the court concluded that despite some ambiguity in the impeachment motion, it was passed illegally and the court has standing to hear the case. By law, she said, an impeachment motion does not require an elaborate debate in the National Assembly. Neither did any lawmaker request one, nor was any prevented from doing so. She added that in impeachment cases, the current law dictates that a trial can proceed when there are seven or more justices present. The court dismissed several of the charges in the impeachment motion, citing a lack of evidence that the president had abused her authority by removing officials from their posts without solid ground or that she appointed personnel at private companies. Lack of evidence was also cited for the charge that the president had infringed on the freedom of the press by reprimanding local media outlets that reported on her longtime confidant Che Sun Shil and Che's inner circle. As for the Seoul Ferry disaster in 2014, in which 304 people died, the ruling said there were difficulties in holding the president accountable for neglecting her duty to protect citizens' lives. Justice Lee, however, said there was a grave constitutional violation in President Park as head of state, giving Che access to state documents, which laid the foundation for Che to use her connection to the president for her own private gain. She also said the president failed to show willingness to get to the bottom of the scandal, not allowing prosecutors to search the presidential office. I think she regarded all these as a, a her lack of the, the president's lack of uh, willpower or the, the regard for the Constitution to pr protect what uh, it contains in terms of uh, uh, giving people the trust that she will uh, uphold it. Not only is this the first time the court has approved an impeachment, it did so with a unanimous vote. Moon Gonyo, Arirang News.